Hello, welcome back. In the last episode, we talked about the Chinese people's name order, and one of our viewers asked me one very good question. He asked, "Then do Chinese people take their husband's name after they get married?" The answer is yes and no. What? Yes, for Chi for people who for Chinese people who are from China mainland, no. No, we never take our husband's name, family name after we get married. No, no. But the answer is yes, if such Chinese people from Hong Kong, from Hong Kong, you got it? Because Hong Kong is a special history. Uh -huh. People from Hong Kong, Chinese people from Hong Kong, after they get married, they can take their husband's last name. Mm -hmm. Okay, and today we will move to the second and last episode for season one Chinese. What, what we will learn today, only two words, but very, very important. What are they? Can you guess how to pronounce this? Zhe. 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 Do you think it's hard for American, for English-speaking countries people to pronounce this one? Look at my mouth. Zhe, zhe, zhe. This one tricks when we one trick when we're learning Chinese. When we're learning this language, learning how to speak, try your best to exaggerate, exaggerate. So forget about oh this is ugly. Uh uh. Forget about that. Look at my mouth. Zhe, zhe. I sacrificed my image to teach you, so when you are alone at home, try to exaggerate when you pronounce zhe, your mouth forward. Zhe, zhe. What does this mean? Super important. Every day you will introduce, you will introduce people, hey, this is my mom, this is my friend. Right? This is my husband, this is my son, this is my family, this is my house. Uh huh. Zhe is very important, very important. Since we learned zhe, how about... That is my dad. That is my favorite movie. Every day, every day, we will speak this and that tons of times. Right? Mm -hmm. Okay, now how to say that? Na. Na. This one is super easy. You have one English word, naive. Has to naive. Has to naive. Exactly the same the first part. Na. 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 Okay, now please tell me how to translate. That is my mom. Na shi wo ma ma. Na shi wo ma ma. Why well, put the here? Because I told you the here. This is optional. Because you feel your mom is very close to you. How to translate? This is my dad. Zhe shi wo. Correct? Okay, after we learned all this and um, this and that, we have learned all the elements or elementary words we need when we introduce others, including ourselves. This is who, that is who, she is who, he is who, I am, you are, I'm Chinese, I'm American, he's Chinese, he's American. Right? So we learned all the introduction. From today, when you want to introduce people, please think about how to say that in Chinese. In Chinese. And also from today, when you want to say this or that, ask yourself how to say that in Chinese. One more time. Zhe. 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 Naive. Na. 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 I see you next episode. Still remember what is Shindan Jie Kuala? 
Merry Christmas， 圣诞节快乐，再见。